I come in? I have me. You would not find me good company. No. I'm sure we'll find lots to talk about. told me before I poured. Why are you here? Uh, just uh, be polite. <coughs> you seem like a calm and reasonable person. say the moment calls for calm. <laughs> yeah. Back before winter set in, there were some misunderstandings. Regrettable ones. But I think we all have a better idea of who we're dealing with. Now, what you did to his boys. Self-defense. Dying is what we Ace here live for. And let's be honest, they were kind of useless. But Balder. He had value. He was my best tracker, my closer. Yeah, his mind was gone, sure. But he had his uses, and now he's gone because of you. You follow me? You have a debt. You're no fun anymore. Peace. How does peace strike the esteemed retired god of war? How about we just don't kill each other? How about you stay home, kick up your feet, seek no quarrel with me, and I'll have none with you. 
course, it means that that one, that one has to stop his search for Tyr. Years old ways are dead. He is dead. You understand? And then that's it. Then we're square. Shit, I'll even sweeten the deal. I'll let you keep the prisoner that I know you stole. <laughs> that's right. I know you're in here somewhere, you silver tongued little shit. Why should we believe a word of you? What of your promises ever been worth? There he is. Old partner in crime. He's lost weight. If he tells you snow is white, he's lying. What kind of wisdom is that? Can't the smartest head alive see past himself? See that we all want the same thing? All right. Here's a deal I know you can trust. I'll settle your debt with my ex. Freya off your back. Keep your boy safe. It's really all you want, isn't it? So what do you say? Fighting dirty, you're not fighting right. Nice try. 
Consider your blood debt paid. It's the end. with the trail. Oh, no. I'll go get a gateway ready. Come on, then. Ain't a long walk. <laughs> All set. This'll get you home. I was about to look for you. I heard. Are you? What does he want? To, uh, pay for the roof. And... he invited me to Asgard. Did he? I couldn't hear once he went outside. I told him no, obviously. Good. Why were you searching for Tia? If I told you I was looking for him, you would have said not to. So you hid the truth from me? I wanted to tell you. I really did, but now that you know, there's something you should see. No. Just trust me, you'll want to. You have broken my trust. Then let me regain it. Let me show you what I found. Besides, we haven't seen the last of Odin. Or Thor. And clearly they can just walk in and blast holes in our home whenever they want. There's only one way to get them off our back. I think I know how. Sir. Change your bastard! Where are we going? The old temple in the Wildwood. Why? It'll be easier to explain once we're there. Though didn't say anything else while you were outside. Yeah. He said he doesn't care about Jotunheim anymore. That the Giants can keep their secrets. He's averted Ragnarok his own way. You think he knows all the Giants are dead? I'm more concerned that it no longer matters to him. What's he up to? But 
happened here. So close to home. Are we just warring with one another now? Those are not their arrows. Something else is out here. Whoa. That one's still alive. No. Look closer. <sighs> Hell Raiders now? Who's doing this? Suppose it's too much to hope that an enemy of theirs would be a friend of ours. Yeah, probably. Raiders like that. Another grizzly scene. I've seen my share of bloodshed, but this is an awful lot for one morning. Winter Freya, the Raiders torn out in Bardingen, and now Stalker's playing in our woods. This is no safe haven anymore. Watching. Well, that's new. Come on, Atreus. Wait. I don't think he's waiting. What is this, lad? 
Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories, the secret stories, those they kept here, inside. You remember the story of Skull and Hati, the wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, this shows the giants setting Skull and Hati free. They're free? Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanaheim. Not the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are, chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Somehow. Atreus. See? Hathi's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. Not totally sure who this is, but someone comes along and rescues the moon. And then, the moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse? I haven't seen one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do with... We're coming to that. Look, here's Ragnarok. Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Right? Mimir. Can this be? Odin told me he killed Tia, and he trusted me at the time, or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? What if he's just had him locked up somewhere all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait. We are going home. Wait. I have one more thing to show you. It's just out here. Everything I found. Well, almost everything. That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jotunheim again? No, I found it in one of the other shrines. Other shrines? How many have you visited? I, well, all of them? All the ones I could still get to in Midgard anyway. I don't know what it is, but it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned, but I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. He mentioned black smoke and the bleeding earth. We can never figure out exactly... We. Uh, Sindri's been helping me. Look, I talked him into it. it. It wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Black smoke. Prison be in Muspelheim. Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the bleeding owl? Sounds like a mine, aye. The realm of the dwarves, perhaps. Sparklefine, that's a good bet. Your mines did belt black smoke, and Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. That's it then. Tears in Svartalfheim somewhere, imprisoned in a mine. So? What now? Remember when we fought our first troll out this way? I remember you lost control. <sighs> we must tread carefully, brother. Danger is course. You okay fighting without a shield? It is not my first time. <laughs> 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 Behind you! 
cover! There's no walking without your shield! As I live and breathe, is that Atreus? It's been so long. <gasps> How you've grown. <laughs> uh, oh, <well>, yeah. <clears throat> well, if you'll follow me, Brock mentioned he needed somewhere safe to spend the night, and I believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that. We're still your favorite dwarves, right? You're still the only dwarves we know. I'll take it. After you, my friends. As you can see, we've settled here in the realm between realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimblewinter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. Intriguing. Come in. Come in! Just wipe your feet very thoroughly. I'll wait. You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? Okay, then. If your bedrooms are there, the kitchen is just over there. Any... Anybody need a snack? Kratos? Snack? I do not need a snack. What we need is your help getting to Sparrow Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. The Tyr? Al alive? I mean, that's... Oh, what? It it's okay. I told him everything. My son and disobeying me. No, I I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just it's just there's it's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was something we needed your help with. Oh, the Holder Brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it, precisely. Hey! Not so fast. How'd that get in here? What the hell is this? This is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. Looks like. That. I blame you. Now, come on, then. Let's get him something that fits at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey, yes. Suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallop. up good <laughs> wouldn't you rather i just whip you up a new one it is important to me well i'll see what i can do in the meanwhile how about i fix you up with something to get you by finding everything all right i hope how do we unlock the realms We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring the head. Uh, yeah. So, where exactly is Tyr being held? He's imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Ooh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. 
Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader from New Mon. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. Well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader, Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you, you just remember things however they pop into your being, don't you? I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. What do you mean, Brock? Will you help us or not? No, oh, never mind. It ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. This smudge sponger notwithstanding. Ignoring you. Fine. Go darken Derlin's door. See for yourself how it goes. Just be warned. He's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. He's cranky as all get out. And he talk funny, too. Sounds like a true study in contrast. We'll just need the Bifrost and the head. Brock? Do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance, then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So, uh, do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your eyes. Oh, oh, Cindy, a stunning bastard! Ah! Ha, 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 Open now! I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it! <laughs> oh! That's it! That's it! Good! Now, release! Still unpleasant! Oh, that's our cue! Come on, hurry! I'm coming, I'm coming! Frostful got eggs, man! What was that for? You'll see soon enough. Just there! That should do it! No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck! Kratos! Throw me at him! Horns first! <laughs> Case you take a joke, you old goat! <laughs> the Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first... Come on, let me show you how it works. your key at the room for Svartalfheim on the right, then concentrate. Whoa, do you feel that? What's that, lad? Anything, everything. It's warm. 